The people are not the wife. The people are the children of God. One cannot be a child of God and the wife as well. That makes no sense at all. God are parents of their family. They are God, the father Melchizedek, God the mother, the Christ who is Lisbeth, and all of you are the spiritual children of God. So I ask all who don't want to accept that they have a spiritual mother and that God our father and mother. What is so wrong with God the father having a wife and that you not only have a spiritual father but also a spiritual mother and that it is not by a son of God that you are saved but by the wife of God, the spiritual mother. And believe me, it is better for you to have me as your spiritual mother, your mediator, because no one else knows God the Father like I do. And he doesn't do anything without me. Everything is made through me and for me. It is so sad that these people are so stubborn. They have a heart of stone. In the eyes of God, they hate the spiritual mother without a justifiable reason. And in summary, I tell you the truth, whoever does not accept that God is father and mother, will not have protection from God and will continue as mere mortals in the hands of the enemy, a slave of the devil, his carnal mind, and in the hands of evil men of their environment, who are in the same mental state or worse than them, and whose end is destruction and death. They are enemies of God. In the secret book of John, it says that he received a secret teaching from God and that God appeared to him as the father, the mother, and the child. Of course, because Christ is the one who has come to show the world the true image of the family of God and what that heavenly family consists of. This is the true trinity and not the one promoted by so-called Christians. That is why what is seen was made of what was not seen. But not everything you see in this world is made of what was not seen. That is why it is so important to listen to Christ speak, because she reveals all the mysteries so you could know the true image and likeness of God and be together with God forever. And it all begins with honoring your spiritual father and mother. That is why the fundamental truth of my manifestation is the reverent fear of God, which is to respect with reverence that God our father and mother. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah.